Hello guys and welcome back to this amazing channel. This is Abhina. In this particular video, we will discuss about the problem rectangle cutting. So this is a a problem of this round nine twenty four. But this was a really confusing problem. I'm not sure, but like uh, not ex actually confusing. But uh, I did four wrong summations for this problem. If you will see here, and even after four wrong summations, I was able to solve this problem. You know. After around one point five hours after the contest, so this is something you know, uh, weird that happens and you know, it it sometimes happens that even for the first problem you do a lot of wrong submissions and you're not able to solve the problem early. I'm not sure if many of you have also faced the same because uh, in this problem I've seen one thing that you have to submit the exact solution what they want means there is very corner case that we are missing. I will check that case that in which case it was failing after the contest. Uh, but let's first discover what the problem is. The problem says that you have a rectangle of size a into b. So you have a rectangle of size a into b. For example, the rectangle is like this. Okay. Now what you can do is you have to cut the rectangle into two parts. Okay, and that cut should be from parallelly to any other side. Like the cut can be like this. So it can be either like this or either like this. And it's not compulsory that it should be at the middle of the triangle, okay, a rectangle. But actually, we will do it always from the middle of the rectangle. Why we will do it always at the middle? Because what they are asking us is that after making this cut, for example, we make we make the, we made a cut cut here. After cut, it became like this. Now what we can do? We can again join that rectangle in the other way. For example, like this. So for this. For this resulting rectangle, its we can say that its width is a by two because it's being half, and its height is b into two. It got doubled, right? So by doing this, what we have to find is that whether we can convert the given triangle into a different triangle, not the same, because in some cases you will get a same triangle. Let me give you an example. For example, you have a triangle like this. This is a triangle, and let's say that the size of this triangle is. 2 into 4. If you will cut it from here, you will get two triangles of size 2 by 2. Am I right? You will get 2 by 2 size triangles. And if you will add these 2 by 2 side triangle in any way, you will again get a triangle of same type which is 4 into 2. It means in this case it's not possible. And in some of the cases even it's not possible to cut the triangle. For example, that you have a triangle like this, which is of size 5 into 3. So for a triangle of 3 into 5, you cannot even cut it from the middle. Because it will then become two triangles of 2.5 and 2.5, but they are saying that it's it's an integer division. Okay. So you cannot cut it. So the first, so see, from here we got around two conditions. First condition is that if we have two sides A and B, both should not be a odd side. So if both the sides are odd, then the answer is no. That's the first thing. And else, the next thing is C. See, from here what we are doing. Here, when we are dividing this by in two and then again we are adding it, it is again added as a same triangle. But in this case, you can see it's a different angle that is formed. Let's say here this is uh, two and let's say this is uh, five. So when you're dividing this two by half, it became one five and one five. And after adding it, it became one ten. So basically, a triangle of size two into five is converted to one into ten, which is fine. Which is which is fine, but you cannot do here because here a triangle of two into four is again converted to two into four or four into two. Both are same. So the condition here basically comes is that first thing is that A and B both should not be odd. If both are odd, your answer is no. Second thing is, for example, A is not odd. Or let's say let's say that a is odd so if a is odd that means b is even because any one of the both should be even at least one should be even so for example if a is odd means b is even if b is even that means we can divide that b by 2 but when we are dividing that b by 2 the resultant should not equal to a that is what happens here when we divide this 4 by 2 resultant we are getting 2 and 2 why I am doing, why I am saying this, for example, for example, you have two sides A and B, you are dividing this A by 2 and you are multiplying this B by 2. 
for example you have sites like two and uh let's say two and four so when you when you will divide this two by let's say you will divide this four by two and you will multiply this by two again it become two and four so this should not be there huh if you will divide in this way divide by two and multiply by two now it's fine so two by comma four can be converted to one comma eight but cannot be converted to four comma two it will remain same right this is the logic what i did is so previously what i was doing is i was actually doing a right solution if you will see here i was taking a, a set in that set i am checking both the possibility first professor possibility when we are dividing x by 2 and multiplying y by 2 second possibility is multiplying x by 2 dividing y by 2 if it is a even but it's giving a wrong answer maybe there is a some corner case but here what i did is next uh, even a easy thing that if if both are odd then obviously answer is no now if y is odd if y is odd that means we can divide x if y is odd but x by 2 is y then also it's no and if x is odd and y by 2 is x then also this in all the other cases the answer is yes right so it was a little bit confusing but i hope that now you have got this particular solution okay thank you for watching this particular video if you still have any doubt you can for sure join our telegram and we will discuss that there and also please do subscribe to the channel if you want more such videos i will upload solutions of the next uh, problems of this contest also so stay tuned thank you